Welcome to the reissue and export license training module. This module will take you through the steps required to reissue a license to export Australian wine using Wallace. Licenses to export remain valid for 12 months after which they will expire. A notification email will be sent to the license holder six weeks prior to the license lapse date. Another reminder email will be sent two weeks prior to the lapse date and a final email on the lapse date if not reissued already. As an exporter, if you reissue your license prior to the lapse date, your license period will be extended for 12 months from the original lapse date. If you choose not to reissue at that point in time, you can reissue the license any time after the license has lapsed. Your license period will be extended for 12 months from the reissue application date. Please note that only exporters with an active ABN can proceed with a license reissue. The license reissue fee is $700 Australian dollars. To request a reissue, log into Wallace with your username and password. From the home page, click on the reissue a license button to begin your application. Select the license to reissue from the licenses available in the export license section using the tick box. Tick the I would like to have my license reissued box. If you don't wish to reissue your license at this point, you can tick the I do not want my license reissued box. Click next to continue. Wallace will check if the ABN and ACN of this entity is still valid. If the entity details are the same, click next to continue. If the ABN details are different, you will need to apply for a new license. The next step is to review the contact details. Make any required changes and scroll down to review all of the information. Check that the trading names are correct. These are the trading names to be used on wine export documentation. You can edit, add or delete other trading names by clicking on any of these buttons. If the entity is a company, you will be required to update the director's details as they appear on the ASIC company extract. If the entity is a partnership, you will need to enter each partner as it appears on the partnership agreement. A partnership agreement will be required to be uploaded as part of the application on the attachments page. If the entity is a trust, you will need to enter the details of the trustees as it appears on the deed of trust. A deed of trust will be required to be uploaded on the attachments page. In this example, we are reissuing a license for a company, so the director's details are displayed. Once all the information is entered, click Next to continue. Review the information entered in the application and make any changes using the Edit button next to each section. Scroll down to continue. Read the declaration at the bottom of the page. Check the tick box to confirm the declaration is read and understood. Click Next to submit. The next step will take you to the Fees page. The license reissue fee is $700 Australian dollars. Click next to continue to the payment gateway for a credit card payment. Payments made by credit card will be processed instantly. If you wish to pay via EFT or check, click on the defer payment button. You will then be emailed a copy of the tax invoice. If payment isn't received by the due date on the invoice, the invoice will be cancelled and you will need to submit your license reissue request again. If you're paying with credit card, you will be directed to the payment gateway. Enter your credit card details and click the checkbox to indicate you are not a robot. Click the pay button to process your payment. A payment confirmation and receipt number is returned to confirm that your payment has been successfully processed. The page can be printed if you wish to retain for your records. A receipt of your payment will also be available in Wallace. Click on the link to return to Wallace. Wallace will confirm your application has been submitted by providing an application record number. Licence reissue records are prefixed with LR. Click on the View Record Details button to view the status of your application. The record status is shown above the Details section. If your application has been entered correctly with no errors and the reissue fee was paid for by credit card, the record status will show as approved and your license will be automatically reissued. 
If there are any issues with your application, the status will show as in progress and approval will be manually processed by the Export Assistance team. You can also view your application status using that View Application Status button at the bottom of the page. Clicking on My Records will show your licence has been reissued. Wallace will send an email to you confirming your licence has been granted. This will also include a PDF copy of your licence. Wallace will also send an email to your nominated contacts with a copy of the licence reissue invoice. This now concludes the reissue and export licence training module. Further training modules can be accessed from the Wine Australia website. For any further help with reissuing a licence, please contact the Wine Australia Export Assistance Team.